welcome back to a home vlog. I have my coffee. I'm sad. It is not my Khalifa Farms. I was out. I'm going grocery shopping. Anyways, I'm on my way to go work out. Today, we are getting our lives together. I'm so tired. I just got back from LA and we went to Era's. It was my birthday. We went to the lake before. We went, we had a live show or I had a live show. Like, it was just... Like my face is permanently puffy. I'm so tired. So today we're getting our lives together I need to go grocery shopping. I need to cook. I need to clean my pool I need to go to Home Depot and get some new plants. It's gonna be a really good home vlog I've been moving all of my workouts back to like 8 a.m. Cuz it's just uh, I'm so tired I cannot take my hands seriously right now. This is what I mean getting our lives together. It's Done with my workout, off to Home Depot. I need two new plants because two of them are done, you'll see. I'm so happy. I just love being home. I love being at Sprouts. It's so much better. This is just giving me fall vibes. Like, it makes me so happy. Lips are looking better. Grocery haul time. I haven't done a grocery haul in so long. I feel like I completely stopped doing those. Um, but I'm gonna make a peach burrata, like grilled chicken salad. I got some salmon, vegetables. I actually got a couple like pre-made things because they were having a sale. I never really get those at Sprouts, so I wanted to try them. Um, especially because, like, what if I'm lazy this weekend or something? I hate when I sh grocery shop, like, too late in the week because that's when I start, like, going to eat with friends and stuff. So, like, I need it, like, Sunday through Wednesday, really, you know? So, anyways, Greens Trio. Um, I had to get herbs because my arrow garden, I killed everything that I grew because I put too much plant food in. But, like, this is how you can see if you need plant food. Like, this will go red, right? And it just like kept going red. So I was like, there's just no way I need that much. And then sure enough, they all died. So I think I just needed to give it a second to adjust. So anyways, I ordered new ones. It's not a big deal. Um, it's fun and it worked well for the time being. And now we're gonna fix it. Um, so I got thyme and basil, carrots and potatoes. I'm gonna make the like bone broth beef stew that I always make. Um, my butcher box also came in today, not sponsored, I wish. I'm a paying customer, I love butcher box. It makes me eat a lot more protein. I've been trying to like incorporate a lot more protein into my diet. And uh, butcher box has been amazing. It's also made me like try out different things that I would like not normally cook and grill and whatever, so I really like it. Um, I got Kodak pancakes because every time my niece sleeps over, I like somehow don't have pancakes, so I needed more of those. Peaches, bone broth. Onion, of course eggs, so I love these things. I know I could just boil eggs myself, but like, if I'm being honest with myself, I'm not gonna do it, and it's just like the best snack ever. So I do that, or sometimes I'll even have it like before a workout, and then I just have actual eggs. Cause I'm making a lot of scrambles lately. Um, breakfast, I like change what I like, and I, like I'll be obsessed with a certain meal, and I'll eat it for like three months straight, and then all of a sudden I can never eat it again, and then I switch, right now I'm on eggs, but That'll change. Khalifa Farms, obviously. You guys know me at this point. These are my favorite snacks. I found them in the like new section of Sprouts. If you can't find them, I've been getting DMs. Look in the new section at my Sprouts and at most that I've been to. It's like in the middle. It's like in between produce and where all of the like nuts and almonds and things are. Um, but anyways, these are Scout Seafood Snacks. They are so good. Um, so you have like a can of tuna and then you have the topping there and there's like a little bit of like olive oil in there it Sounds weird, but it's so good. So you guys just have to trust me so good. I'm telling you right now I'm realizing now I got a lot of food. I went to the grocery store hungry. So burrata for my salads obviously cottage cheese because it's my go-to for everything these days This is the pre-made stuff that I got um, I just got grilled chicken for my salads because here's the thing like 
I hate making salads, and so I'm like, I wonder if I just get things that are already made and I just throw it together, if it'll make me make it more. You know what I mean? Especially, like, at lunch, when I'm in the middle of working, like, I don't want to, like, spend an hour and a half in the kitchen, like, making a salad, because you have to, like, do everything. Like, it, actually, a lot of them take longer than you think. So we're gonna try that. I got this herb butter salmon meal. I think a friend is coming over, so I was like, I might as well get us like something to eat. Um, I got the black garlic chicken and mushroom saute meal. I know I love this, I'm gonna have this for lunch. And then I just got some Brussels sprouts for sides. So, got a little bit more than I normally do today, but it's for the best. I will not be eating out. I don't wanna be leaving my house, even though I literally have to leave tomorrow, besides like workouts and stuff. Um, but yeah, lots of good stuff. Back to my routine, back to cooking, back to eating healthier. I will say I feel horrible. I'm just spending the past week in LA and just like being off my routine. Like I'm so, I'm not even like, okay, like, I'm so reliant on it, but like there's so many small things that I could do when I travel and that I normally do that I just like feel fine. The city of Los Angeles drains me as is, but like if I'm traveling for work by myself, I'm, I'm still working out, I'm still doing things, so like I'm okay. Um, but like, oh my god, I'm just so tired. Also, I went to Eras, and oh my god, I didn't, oh, obviously you guys saw in the vlog. I think I'm an Eras hangover from Friday, and it's Wednesday. Like, I'm still exhausted, and I only went one night. Last time I went two nights in a row, and like, I'm just, I'm not okay. I got so much stuff. I don't even know what plan I'm on anymore, but this is more than I normally get, and I did change my plan, but it's just amazing, especially for entertaining. So I got a whole chicken, some beef patties, which will be great for like grilling last minute, a lot of salmon, which looks great, ground beef, ground beef. I also got ground bison, which I also really like actually. But again, tried it because of butcher box. These are, I think steaks, yeah, right? Grass-fed steaks, chicken breast, and then grass-fed beef ribeye steaks. So the reason too that this is so great is because they're grass finished so like a lot of things can be grass fed their whole life and then at the very end they like pump up the like animal um but if it's grass finished it means it was like all the way through their lifetime so it's a lot better all around there's just so much of it this is the part of my tan that I'm at. Like that's how you know you need to like get it together. I got some work done, today's my day to recharge. I'm gonna work a little bit later, but I wanna go in the pool, now that I have my pool, and read and, oh, we will talk about the book that I started reading yesterday. Okay, I'm hoping that the chlorine like takes my tan off and then I'm gonna scrub it all off later. I'm also gonna wear, the thing is like, how do I wear this and also have my hair up so it doesn't get wet? I guess like this. Anyways, this hat from Revolve, it's one of my best purchases that I've made this summer because it's a packable hat and it's perfect for like the lake, the beach, the pool, whatever. Anyways, the book that I'm reading, I think I found it on Goodreads because I was going through um, just authors that I've liked previously and Rebecca Yaros wrote, what is the name of that book with the mailbox on it? Let me find it. I, keep, I always forget the name of it. She wrote Fourth Wing and then the book that all of us loved with the mailbox on it. That I'm like totally blanking on the name. And then In the Likely Event. And this is the cover. It has like a little airplane on it. I just thought it sounded good. And then I started reading it. And I've been really out of my like reading routine. I'm seven books behind right now on my goal for the year which I'm like way too stubborn to change the goal. I'm normally like five books ahead, but I just feel like my like day to day has been so different. I just like haven't been on a reading kick. So I've got to like really amp it up. Comment below, short book wrecks. Like I need like 200 page books that I can like knock out in a day. Um, but hopefully like I'm home for the next two weeks and then it still is hot all of September and October. So I'm planning on just like sitting by the pool and reading a ton and just relaxing. So anyways, I'm gonna hopefully finish it today. I'm at 44%. I would like to finish it by tonight. But another good thing about having a pool is that like I don't care about like what swimsuit I'm wearing. Like when I go places, it normally has to be like a look. Like I like the swimsuit, it's cute, whatever. Like it's just me, myself, and I, so I will throw on like whatever I have. So anyways, I'm gonna go read. I also just ordered some rafts because I can like fully like spread out on this pool. Barely, but I can. And then I ordered on Amazon, I'll add it to my um, pool storefront. I ordered, 
I can't take myself seriously with this hat. Um, a little like drink and snack tray so it floats. So I can like keep like a margarita out there or like coffee or whatever it is. I also wanna like wake up and go in the pool. Like I just wanna be like a pool girl. Like I live in this pool, that's the point. My deck, I got a quote and I'm hearing back from them today about when they can do it. The deck was the more expensive part of the pool. Um, I got my stock tank pool from a business, it's like stock tank love or something. Um, and they do stock tanks. I would just look it up because there's a lot of businesses that have come out of COVID, depending on where you live. Um, but it's a way more cost effective way of getting a pool. It's obviously not like a real, real pool, but it, it, it is. It has like a filter. Like it's enough, you know, for me. I did my pool chores and I filled up the pool. I'm on like 60% of this book, it's so good. I just finished that book and I cried. It was so good, I sat in the pool for the past two hours. I honestly could go for the rest of the day, but I do need to get some stuff done. It was so good, one of the best books I've read all year, if not the best book I've read all year, unbelievable i just am now downloading another book by her and i'm gonna read that tonight like i cannot get over how good that book was like unbelievable you have to read it he just looks so happy fits come on bub let's go inside <laughs> showered and i changed into my set pajamas that i wear literally all the time i was gonna tan but i think i'm gonna hold off on that and get a little bit of work done. I made a snack and a drink. All I wanna do is read another Rebecca Yaros book, but I'm gonna get my work done. I'm gonna watch the podcast. Wednesday night is the best night for podcasts. I made this salad, it was so easy. Grilled peaches, grilled chicken, just a greens mix, balsamic vinaigrette, burrata. It looks so good. I have laundry that I need to put away, as always lately. I feel like I just haven't had all of it done and taken care of in so long. Also, my pool is so clean. I cleaned it when I was in there. Obviously couldn't film, but it's looking amazing. I also filled it up. Um, okay, so I ordered on Cider, and I was like, I don't know if this is legit, but I just kept getting served their Instagram ads, and I was like, I need this. And I haven't tried them on yet, but so far they're really cute. I love like a tall fabric, like print. So, got this cute little like white and pink dress. I have this dress, which I feel like is gonna be too short. I can't tell, like, eh, it's like, eh, eh, we'll see. This top, I just need tops in general. Like, that's the thing that I never ever have. I always have dresses, I know I never have tops, but this would be so cute, which is like jeans, a belt, and boots. I ordered um, a new belt from Revolve today, a brown belt. I'm like so into belts currently. I should go through and do all this, but guys, like, I just felt like after this day, I'd be, like, recharged and ready to go, and I'm honestly just so exhausted. Like, I'm so tired. So, I think we're just gonna chill and start a new Rebecca book. Guys, happy Friday, Kelsey Ballerini's, um, like, healed version, rolling up the welcome mat. So the last time, what is it called? Whatever, like the healed version came out so good. Um, I'm about to go work out. I have just like, I don't even know how to describe it. I've just been so, this week I have been more tired than ever, but today we're gonna finish getting our lives together. I honestly don't even wanna do anything this weekend. Like I wanna stay in and sleep. That's all I wanna do. So we'll see, but I'm going to work out. For my workout, I have a ton of Amazon packages. Most of these are for the pool. I need like a drink tray for the pool. I also really want that Home Depot, like it's a cooler but on wheels, but it's tall because it's literally perfect for bringing out by my pool. I need to just order it. I got these, um, I'm gonna add these to my Amazon storefront and our hosting, but I'm doing a shoot on Monday and I needed, I had this like vision for like white vases. I kind of want more. We'll see. I think that's actually probably gonna be fine. Um, but this is like a really good price and these are really nice looking 
vases. So that's exciting. Here we go. I just like, I don't know. Maybe I'll get more, but I really like these. So I get asked a lot like how to host on a budget and I'm gonna do TikToks on it. Um, honestly, like my entire Amazon storefront under hosting is really how you host on a budget. I would just say like get one set of vases and then just get one like plain set of dishware, servingware, whatever, and then you can use things like ribbon and whatnot to like personalize it more. There's definitely ways to do it. Hosting is like a pricier hobby, I guess, but it's not like impossible. Like there's ways around it. And then also I get a lot of my stuff, I thrift most of my stuff. So like a lot of my dishware and stuff like would be really expensive, but like I'm not, I can't pay that, I'm not paying that. Um, oh, my new era garden stuff came in, so we'll be fixing the herb garden today because it's looking really, really rough. I cannot believe I messed that up so bad when it was literally perfect and they had grown so much. <gasps> Love that for me. My blinds are finally coming today and then like that will be totally set up. I know I keep saying like, oh, and then it's gonna be done and then it's gonna be done and then it's gonna be done at the house, but I really feel that way after the deck is built with the pool, pretty much everything is done. I'm sure in the long run, I'll switch out the living room stuff and then I'll probably do something different with the guest bedroom. Oh, I also got, okay, this is what I like. So these match and these are little like tapered candles. Oh, I don't know if this candle stick set will work. These are pink. You guys will see I'm vlogging the whole thing, but it's like a surprise. So y'all will see all of it. I just don't know if, it's going to, mm, oh no, it works. Or great, so that's exciting. So that's gonna look good. I might even start setting up that tablescape today, just depending on my vibe. I feel like the second it hits Friday at five today, I'm gonna be like so productive and back and whatever, even though like all week, oh, it was just so hard for me to focus. I ordered a fun boy pool float. I got another pool net because I just needed one with a stick. closet right now but I'm trying on new clothes and I love this dress from cider I'll show y'all in a second I also I'm not gonna put this back on I should have filmed it but I got this denim set from on 34th which is like Macy's new line it first off like I got these black pants from them I wore them when I was in LA and they're like work pants they're like nice slacks great for working girls actually and they are the most comfortable pair of pants I have ever worn in my entire life. I also need to shower, so this is gross, but I've ever worn in my entire life. Like, oh my God, I'm obsessed with them. So I'll link those, but that's like a denim bell bottom set. And then this, and it cinches at the waist. It's so cute with heels. The denim's long on me. Um, definitely wearing heels with it, but so cute. I will definitely be getting my wear out of it. So anyways, love this. This dress, guys, I'm in love. It is long enough. It's going to be so cute, especially with, like, this is the pair of boots that I'm thinking. These Tacovas, These suede. Oh, my God. I'm going to Sam Hat next weekend, so maybe I'll wear this. I honestly want to wear it this weekend, but I might I might save it. I might wait. So, anyways, love that. I also have, like, an Amazon dress I'm going to try on and see. I also need to do some shopping um, for Nantucket because we leave soon. It's the August 11th. I'm getting my deck. It's going to be start to be built. 21st when I get back to Nantucket, it's gonna be ready for me. So I need to go to Home Depot and pick out stains I feel like I'm really finally like in the headspace to do things whereas all week I was not last but not least I got this in black and pink. I don't know where the pink one went it's somewhere in here um, I also have like all my pajamas over here because I haven't even moved them. I'm definitely wearing this today It's cute. It's like a free people knockoff from Amazon because the free people one um, Was out of stock. I normally like for something. I don't know. I just think it's cute. Um, here's the back of it. I do have a little burn from the pool from reading, but so cute, right? Okay, I just blew up my fun boy float and I figured out or I realized that I have a little cup holder here. This is very exciting, right? Oh my God. I kind of think I could maybe fit two. I actually definitely could fit two. Dang it, I should have gotten both. 
This is where I'll be all weekend. I can't wait for this to actually look beautiful and my article chairs to come in. But this is very exciting. I definitely need to. So here are the blinds. It looks so much better. It just makes the room feel even nicer. Like something about it. Fitz is literally always here. Okay. Oh God. Everything is falling. Giving you guys a little view. A little view of my outfit. So this is the dress. It's really wrinkled today. It would be cuter if it wasn't so wrinkled. And then I have my shoes on as you guys saw. And then I have my normal jewelry and my Jenny Bird sunglasses, Jenny Bird earrings, Jenny Bird sunglasses. I think I left my dangly heart earrings somewhere. I think I lost them in LA. And if that's true, I will sob because those are my favorite earrings. And I love them and they're like $100. It's so annoying. But anyways, we're off to M Sculpt. Okay, I got my fifth session of M Sculpt done. And it has actually done wonders. I've not really done many things that I feel like, besides like my ear sculpt on my face, I feel like a lot of the stuff just are like scammy. They don't really do much or whatever. I will say like I do work out also and eat pretty healthy, but yeah, very impressed. Um, my legs are so much stronger. I'm listening to Kelsey Ballerini's, bring up the Malcolm mat for good. So I'm heading home, gonna get a little bit of work done and then I'm like dying to go into the pool and I think I'm going to Macy's tonight. So it's gonna be a great afternoon. And like, it's like, this is what I'm used to. So now that he's like sharing it and millions of people are like liking it too. It's just like, it's awesome. Bro, oh, it's so funny. He's so funny. I just love y'all's friendship because it does seem just so like pure and genuine. Yeah. And it reminds you of like your, like my, it reminds me of my best friends. Yeah. And it's just, I don't know, there's something about it. And I love the laugh track. I think it like makes the video better. You yeah. Know? Yeah. I mean, it's, it's like, like I said, like, Jules and I like have been there for him and he's been there for us like through whatever so it, it is very like genuine and like we love him and like he loves us and it's so funny like one of his like fan accounts made like an edit of us the other day like Brett and Jake and 